Good morning, good Friday, great Friday. It's good to see you all, it's good to be back. Um, I was not here last week because I got COVID. My voice still sounds a little weird, um, so bear with me on that. There's also, I've got some Kleenex handy um, because <laughs> there's a good chance I'm gonna need it. I'm, I'm doing much better. I'm feeling more or less back to normal. Um, but there's just a little coughing, a little bit of nose blowing going on still. Um, but yeah, that's why I was not here last week. But it's good to see you. It's good to be back. And um, yeah, we're going to play some music today. It's very bright in here, as you've probably noticed. We're sort of entering the time of year where I get a lot of sunlight in this room at this time of day. So... Good to 
to see you again. PJ, welcome back. Bob, hi. Aki and Annie are here. Pixie Puppet, can I stay for a few? Wanted to say thanks for the music, girl. You're very welcome. Thank you for saying thank you. <laughs> Viola, buddy. Hope the rest of your recovery goes well. Me too. I think it should. I think so. Surrupturus. That's a good name. Howdy. Not so much singing the stream. That, you know, I hadn't really thought about it, but yeah, I think you're probably <laughs> right on that one. Ellen, good morning. Good to see you. Welcome back. Um, we do have, in case you haven't noticed the stream title, we've got a video premiere happening right after stream today. Um, so Casty, the apothecary from Octopath Traveler 2, is ready for your ears and your eyes. So we'll be doing that um, right after stream. Maybe I should, well... I was like, oh, I should like pin the link. It's in the description. There's also a redirect that should send you there when the stream ends. Like, you, you'll figure it out, you know? <coughs> but yeah. Yeah, so that's what we're gonna do after stream today. student. Awesome. Excellent. 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 All right, let's play some music. Um, let's see. What should we start with today? Uh, maybe let's do, let's do a little To the Moon. Do a little Four River. Kay, welcome back. Good to see you.
to the moon there for us to start off. I feel a bit weird about my bench position. <sighs> Just move that a little bit. Something like that. <clears throat> Lynn, good to see you. Welcome back. Pancake, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Alright. I feel like I've been going maybe just a little too hard on the practicing this week. <laughs> My shoulders are a little sore. Oh, well, you know, note to self. Take it easy this weekend. <laughs> you got a Zoom meeting you forgot about? Well, go get on your meeting then. Have a good one. Alright. Let's keep it going. We'll do a little bit of Zelda next. I was practicing this one this week. Um, it says Terrytown from Breath of the Wild, to which the sequel is coming out very, very soon. So, did you guys see the gameplay trailer that came out? Because that has me pretty excited. I think there's a lot of fun stuff that you're gonna be able to do in the new, the new Zelda game that's coming out next month. But for now, here's Terrytown. Zelda for us there. A little bit of heart percussion. I don't usually do a ton of heart percussion, but I feel like it fits nicely in this one. But, uh, hope I'm all better now. I'm like almost better. I haven't done another test yet, but I feel like 
I'll probably do it today or tomorrow, but I'm mostly better. <clears throat> but yeah, thanks everyone. <laughs> thanks everyone. I feel like I'm just not feeling my sitting position today. Shift a little bit that way. Yeah, that's a little better. Okay. I'm picky about how I sit. Okay. Uh, let's do. Let's do some Octopath Traveler next. We're gonna do Octopath One <laughs> for now. One thing I was thinking of the other day, it might be fun to do a stream where I just like try to learn some of the tracks by ear. <coughs> I think that could be fun. But not today, I think. So for now, we'll just play a little bit of Alfin. Have I been enjoying Octopath 2? I enjoyed it very much. I'm pretty much done at this point. There is one like super boss at the end that's just like stupidly hard and I've just been like, mm, I don't know, maybe I'll go back for it later. I just kind of didn't feel like it. Um, <laughs> Octopath 3.1, it's been a while since 2 was released. <sighs> yeah, it's, uh, it's a good game though. I really, really enjoyed it. I think that like everything that they added like, new stuff from the first game, I think, just, like, made it all just so much better. Um, I think that, like, exploring felt really fun in that game. I think the character stories were, like, really intriguing, and I, like, wanted to know what was going to happen next. I think mechanically there's some really cool stuff that they did. Um, I do think, on the whole, for me personally, it felt a little too easy. Just a little. Um, but, eh, it's a minor complaint. And overall, I really, really enjoyed it. All right, let's do a little bit of Alf in here.
oh, a little bit of elf in there. Gabriel, welcome back. Hello. <clears throat> Octopath 1 was the first game I bought in five years and it blew me away. Yeah. It's relatable. Except for the not buying games for five years. <laughs> that part's not relatable to me, but Octopath did blow me away. I do enjoy a good video game. I, you know what, I didn't play a lot of games while I was in university. Well, the first maybe two years I did it, and then I was like, I can't do it anymore. <laughs> I need games. I love them too much. Okay, hold on, I need a nose blow break, so I'm just gonna mute my... my Awakening was not my favorite, but my gaming diet consists just of SNES and PS1 RPGs. I mean, you know, to each their own. If that's your thing, more power to you. Uh, my reason for not playing games when I was in university was actually more so just because, like, it would aggravate my pain in my hands, so I tried to stay away from it when I could. Um... Although, I still was just like, no, I can't, like, I, <laughs> I still need to play games. I just would, like, try to manage, like, how long I played for, you know, put the controller down and, and whatever. But, uh, yeah, there were times when I was like, okay, I need to stop using my hands because the pain is flared up. So I, I literally, once, like, I went to the university library and I got an anthology of all of Jane Austen's works. <laughs> I read all of them because I was like, okay, if I'm reading, I'm not using my hands. Have I played Baldur's Gate? I have not. Um, I played Divinity Original Sin, which... I, th I don't know if it's that similar. Or Original Sin 2, I should say. But... I have not played Baldur's Gate. <coughs> I was playing this week, because I finished Octopath. And I was like, I don't know, I just want something silly to play for a minute. I, w I have, like, the Nintendo Online subscription. So, uh... I was like, what's what are what's an old game that like I want to just play? So I was like, all right, let's go, Pokemon Puzzle League. Basically, it's just like a mobile game, um, <laughs> but before people had mobiles, obviously. Uh, <laughs> so that was fun. I beat it on hard mode, so I was like, all right, I'm done with this now. Okay, next song we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna do Promise of the World from Howl's Moving Castle. I don't remember if I played this last time, but I've been, like, getting it ready for performance, so I'm like, let's go. Should be in pretty good shape, I think. So. Alright.
section in the middle I'm always like here it comes but it went pretty well I think overall <laughs> thanks everyone thank you thank you appreciate it all right uh, so I'm ready to start taking some requests so if there's any songs you'd like to hear um, feel free to put them in the chat. Um, just a reminder, if you're new here or haven't been here in a while, I can't play everything that's requested for various reasons, so thanks in advance for being cool about it. We appreciate it. Um, <clears throat> generally speaking, um, if there's a song that you know, that I know how to play already, that has a pretty good chance of being played. If it's on VG Lead Sheets, that has a pretty good chance of being played. Muse score, I can make do with. If there's no sheet music, I, I can't play it. Um, have I ever watched Death Note? I have, um, when I was in high school. So that was a long time ago. <laughs> okay, so Verdant Turf Town, definitely we could do that. Ori, main theme? Yeah, we could do that for sure as well. Okay, good, good start. <clears throat> Choose Anarchan? Yeah, we can do that for sure. All right, some good requests getting lined up already, awesome. Um, also just a reminder, We've got a video premiere after the stream, so make sure you stick around uh, for that. Uh, but let's get started with, let's do Verdant Turf Town um, first. Mm, Pokemon, here we go. <clears throat>
interesting ending there. That's Verdant Turf Town. What's the region you all started with? Uh, well, okay. The first Pokemon game that I played was a friend's copy of, I think, Fire Red? Is that true? I don't know. My sister had a copy of Platinum. I played that except for the Elite Four because I couldn't beat it. And she was like, uh, I want to play this now. <laughs> it's my game. So, <clears throat> I guess Platinum. And then I think I played an emulator of Emerald. And then I did X, but X was definitely my favorite. Uh, I'm not going to do any singing today, Ectobass, because my voice is a little weird from COVID still. <clears throat> so we're just going to, I think, steer clear of that for today. Um, but let's see, we had a request for um, Ori. Uh, it's funny though talking about like Pokemon region I, I don't remember which region goes with which game except for like I know Johto is the second one I think Kanto is the first one <laughs> after that I'm like dude I don't know <laughs> I don't know okay <clears throat> Ori oh oh you wanted Will of the Wisps hmm I have Blind Forest let me see if I can find Will of the Wisps if I'm lucky, it'll be on VG Lead Sheets, but we'll find out. Mm, no, they don't have it. Okay, let's do a quick search on MuseScore. If I could spell it correctly, that'd be helpful. Um, <clears throat> main theme. Okay, I think I can do this. Let's take a look here. From what I heard, COVID might have a lot of post-nasal drip. That's that's my experience so far. <laughs> so, okay. <clears throat> oh, the Bilbo made an appearance. Nice. <laughs> He's been pretty good for us so far. Not too much whining for lunch yet. All right. Okay. Let's let's try the main theme from Ori and the Will of the Wisps. I haven't played this before.
like that. I like how there's like some parts that are very similar to the to the blind forest and parts that are different. <laughs> Bilbo is singing for me. I know. I just was saying that he was being good and not singing, and then I mean, he must have heard me and said, "Well, then I guess it's time for me to make my appearance." Um, okay, let's see. Anything from Final Fantasy VI? I should have something from Final Fantasy VI. Let me see. Um, I have a few. Let's do um, Kids Run Through the City Corner because I, that one looks not super hard to play. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, okay. To it. I kind of forgot about it, but it's a good one. Thanks for that request. An Easter song? <laughs> the Bunny Day song? Oh my gosh. Who else doesn't like the Bunny Day event? I think the first time, like the first year of Animal Crossing, I didn't mind it that much, but then it's like, then the next year you're like, I have to wait through like weeks of just everything being eggs. Also, Zipper is just like the most unhinged Animal Crossing NPC. I'm trying to think if there's any other Animal Crossing NPC that's more unhinged. I don't think there is one. Um, speaking of Zipper though, um, I decided to change my like Nintendo Switch profile picture to Zipper. Because <laughs> I just thought it'd be funny. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, I think the Easter events in the previous games were better. I kind of generally, I think, preferred some of the events on like the older games. I just felt more... I don't know what it was, but they just felt more engaging to me. But... Um... 
I don't know of any other Easter like video game songs, so. <clears throat> Someone asked for a hymn of the faith. I don't think I have that one. I can check if it's on VG Lead Sheets, but I sort of. Doubt it, but we'll find out. Do, do, do. Yeah, no, it's not there. That's okay. Da, da, dee, da, da, da. Do, 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 do. New Horizons is great, but feels incomplete. I'm not sure if I agree with it being incomplete, necessarily. I just didn't love the events that much. <laughs> I really like decorating in New Horizons, so it's really fun. Um, I'm trying to see what else have y'all requested today. Oh, someone wanted um, to Xanarchand from Final Fantasy X. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that next. <clears throat> Before we do that though, uh, we're gonna have another nose blowing break, so. All right, I'm ready. Locked and loaded, let's go. To Xanarchand, coming up next. says I still read it as Assassin's Creed New Horizons. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Thanks. 
thank you, thank you. Uh, we do still have about 20 minutes actually, so I set the video premiere for 12.15, which is in 25 minutes from now, just so that we don't have to rush to end the stream. Um, so yeah, I'm happy to take more requests um, if we've got them. Um, Ectoblast asked for something from Bowser's Inside Story. I'll see if they have it on VG Lead Sheets. Um, I am doubtful though. Oh, no, they do have Inside Story, okay. Um, let's see, let's take a look. Mm, that one looks a bit hard. Okay, they have Cavi Cape, Grasslands All the Way, and the Grand Finale. Uh, I'm not sure how any of these are going to sound, to be honest. <laughs> I'll maybe try Cavi Cape, um, just to see. Yeah, let's try Cavi Cape. Um, it looks doable. I don't know about easy, but it looks doable. <laughs> okay. Um, let's take a look. We've got a lot of sharps and things. It's like, yeah, it's totally in D minor. I'm like, is it? <laughs> okay, well, we'll find out. Thing that I feel like doing. 
There's still time for requests as well, if anyone wants one. Hi, Bilbo. I know you're probably getting hungry. He's a hungry boy. What can you say? Um, why don't we do a little more Final Fantasy VI? Hello! You want some Final Fantasy? He says no, I want food. Yeah. You want some food? Poor baby. <laughs> Langstrand, nice to see you. Alright, let's do, um... Let's do Terra's theme, I think. <clears throat> theme there from Final Fantasy VI. Nora has made her appearance. She's like nosing her way through the curtain so she can look outside. I felt bad this morning because she's like had like the perfect like sunny nap spot on the on the mat but uh, it's just too bright. <laughs> it's just too bright. So I had to close the curtains. <clears throat> Aurora. I've never heard of it. Um, I'll take a quick look on VG Lead Sheets. Never know. No dice, unfortunately. She must have been so offended. Well, I gave her lots of pets first, so I think she was okay. <laughs> I think she was okay. All right. Um, we've got a little bit of time left still. <clears throat> no, what we haven't done today is um, we haven't done Primrose. 
So why don't we take a stab at that? Grandpa's theme from Stardew Valley. I can take a look. Let's do Primrose and then I'll take a look for that one. And we'll take a look for Child Light. Oh, now we've got all the good requests. Good, good. Okay, let's do Primrose real quick and then we'll get some other ones in. All right. in pretty good shape. Oh, I see. Well, it makes sense that Aurora wouldn't come up if that's not the name of the game. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, well, let me see. I'm sure they've got to have something from Child of Light. Right? They don't. Oh, man. Okay, well, there's probably something on MuseCore. Um, but let's maybe just check for Stardew while I'm here. Okay, I have to look for that one as well. Uh, okay. Okay, Child of Light. That's what I'm looking for. Aurora's theme. I'm going to guess that's maybe what you were looking for. <laughs> <coughs> All right. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. This is quite slow, all right. Sorry, I'm just like, cannot compute the tempo. Okay. I wasn't far off. I just can't. 
can't figure out what the... Okay, I've had enough. Metronome, thank you. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Child of Light songs have an Octopath vibe, and I remember that's your thing. That is true. I haven't played Child of Light, and I'm not super familiar with the soundtrack, but uh, I know a lot of people really like it, so I'll probably give it another listen sometime. But thank you, everyone. Okay, 1208. All right, <clears throat> that one took a little longer than I expected. So let's um, let's do our finishing song. We're gonna do Lon Lon Ranch to finish. Um. Our new Lon Lon Rush to finish, and then after that, we've got a new video premiere. So, uh, my first cover from Octopath Traveler 2 is on tap, coming up next. Um, so, the stream should redirect you to that once once we're done. We have one more song. Um, if it doesn't, there's also a link in the description um, to use to get there. So, uh, without further ado, I just want to make sure we've got lots of time. We're not late for the premiere because that's just like just be sad, you know. <laughs> It'd just be sad. Um, but yeah, besides that, uh, I don't really have any other announcements other than um, if you live in Winnipeg or the Winnipeg area, I am playing a live concert um, April the 18th at the Rec Room, Winnipeg. Um, there's tickets for that. You can find them on my website. Um, but yeah, otherwise, we'll play our last song. <coughs> Here we go. Mon Lon Ranch. And then we'll head over to the video premiere.
Thanks everyone for coming. Um, thank you for chatting, for lurking, for watching videos, for commenting, for sharing with people who you think might like my stuff, for listening on Spotify, for anyone who's a member, to all my patrons as well. Thank you very much. I do really appreciate it. Um, it really does go a long way to help me keep making content like this, so I really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today's stream. Um, now, we've got to head over to uh, the video premiere. So we've got a couple of minutes before it starts. So don't panic if you don't get redirected. There is a link um, in the live stream description. Um, that'll take you there as well. Um, so I'll see you on that page. But before that, I just want to say, have a great weekend. Um, regardless of what you're doing or if you're celebrating something or not. Just have a great weekend. Try to get some rest. Remember to drink some water. And uh, I'll see you over on the premiere page for my cover of Casti, the Apothecary. All right. See you over there.